uh, I have MS, uh, relapse remitting. One morning I got up and I couldn't lift my left leg up. I've been dealing with uh, this disability for four years now. I tried everything, um, uh, medication, uh, alternative doctors, acupuncture, uh, but nothing really changed, made a big change. I asked people around, people that were here um, told me all about it, how the experience was. And I heard a lot of good things, so um, decided to come. Every procedure, they always explain what they're gonna do. Doctors really did everything uh, they could to make me feel better. And then uh, I hope to see great results. So, uh, hi, my name is Khen. I'm 29 years old. Uh, I have MS, uh, relapse remitting, and basically uh, I've had a relapse four years ago. Um, where uh, one morning I got up and I couldn't lift my left leg up. And I've been, de I've been dealing with uh, this disability for four years now, um, having some trouble uh, walking, uh, have some bladder con control issues and chronic pain. Um, I didn't start with medication straight away. Um, uh, it took time. And I mean, at first I was fine. I had little symptoms like chronic pain, um, weird uh, tingly feelings in my hand, um, but um, as the illness progressed, uh, I, I, I got more and more symptoms, and uh, this, the last relapse was the worst, uh, which affected my, my left leg. So I, I got all kinds of uh, medications. Um, in the beginning, I started off with um, um, injections and then I got a few other conventional medications. Um, nothing really um, stopped the disease. It continued. Um, over the years uh, I still had new symptoms, um, new small relapses. Also I had a relapse in my eyes, in my vision. Um, uh, but it passed away pretty fast. I, I also tried um, alternative medicine. It did relieve my pain at the moment, but it, ne it didn't really help me for the long run. Um, and now I'm trying this stem cell therapy, um, hoping to see results. Um, medication, uh, alternative doctors, acupuncture, um, try changing my, uh, my diet, uh, but nothing really made a big change. So I, I heard about stem cell treatment years ago, but I never really considered it. Um, I thought that maybe it's more for people who, have a, 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 who are in a worse state than me. Um, and then um, a year ago or something like that, my uh, like a friend of a friend uh, mentioned something about Swiss Medica. And then I looked into it um, and I read a lot about it. I, I had a consult, an online Zoom consultation with, uh, um, with a doctor from Swiss Medica. And I was still not sure after the, I mean, she did give me all the information, but um, I was still doubting it because for me it was, you know, it was something new, it was scary. It's, I don't know, I've never been to Serbia. Uh, so I wasn't sure and I just, I didn't, I, I waited, I didn't do anything and then uh, after something like half a year, eight months, something like that, I, um, I started thinking about it again and I did more research. Um, I asked people around, uh, I went online, I went on Facebook, there are all kinds of groups and people that were here um, told me all about it, how the experience was, and I heard a lot of good things. So um, decided to come. I tried to look on the website uh, to read more about people who have MS. I did, I did see more stories about people who are much older than I am. Uh, and I understand that um, um, younger people um, in a better stage like, like I am, um, they have a bigger chance of seeing results. Um, mm -hmm. 
So I just went for it. I've been here for two weeks. I got my own stem cells and also donors. They took um, the stem cells out of my bone arrow. And then uh, it's, I don't know, there's a procedure. After two hours, uh, they, brought, they brought a new syringe um, and then they injected my own stem cells into my spine. Um, and then I had to rest a lot because you have to lay down. You cannot get up for too long. You have to lay down for the entire day. For a few days, I did not feel so well, which is normal after this procedure. You have to rest a lot. Um, but it's after a few days, I was, I was back to normal. First of all, there were side effects, but the doctors told me in advance uh, what the possible side effects could be. Um, and they, you know, they assured me that um, so I won't get scared or freaked out if I feel these things. Um, the procedure was, uh, it was not easy, but the doctor was very gentle. Um, it's, it's not an easy procedure. It's a bit painful, but he was... Which he, one? Um, the bone arrow. Bone was, arrow. It, mm -hmm. That was the hardest part because there, there was also um, uh, intramuscular injections. Uh, which is also not so pleasant, but the, the hardest part was the bone narrow procedure. Um, and the, it was painful, but the doctor was really gentle. And before every procedure, they always explain what they're gonna do. Um, they give like, they give an, a, an exact um, plan, like how explanation of how, what they're gonna do. The side effects that I had were a uh, headache. It was a very strong headache and uh, nausea. Um, there's also a side effect of, for instance, fever, but I did not have fever, so it's very individual. Um, everyone experiences different. It was uh, three, four days. Uh, so it's funny because the first day I didn't feel anything. The second day I was I was okay, maybe a, a bit of a of a headache, but I was fine. And then the third day, um, it hit me. And uh, the third day was the most difficult day. And then the next day I went shopping. Yeah, but the third day it 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 was such a bad headache that I was scared. And the doctors really did everything uh, they could to make me feel better. And then really the next day I. I couldn't believe that I went shopping the next day. It was, it was funny. They made fun of me because I was being a bit over dramatic. I was I was really scared in the moment when I didn't feel well, and then the next day I I went shopping, so I was okay. It was a combination of, uh, of course, um, my own stem cells through the spine, and then uh, the rest was through the vein. Yeah. And also there was one procedure that was intramuscular on my left leg. So okay. injections in my, uh, into the muscle. So every second day there are different uh, kinds of uh, vitamins, but I got every day after my, uh, usually after my um, infusions of the stem cells, I, I always got uh, uh, different kinds of vitamins, the, the ones that I needed according to my blood results. Physiotherapy, I didn't do much. I just had to lay down and a therapist put uh, some kind of electrolytes on my, on my left leg. Um, and they basically do all the work. Um, it, uh, from my understanding, it makes the weak muscle work. Um, also, there was this machine um, that um, that was pumping up the the muscles. I don't know exactly how to explain. Um, so basically, you don't have to do uh, much hard work. Um, it's it's physiotherapy with with uh, different kinds of machines. I'm being I'm so um, hopeful that I that my body could go back to how it was one stage before, which is basically before the relapse in my uh, left leg. Um, so I, I do wish to, uh, to see an improvement in my walking. 
um, and uh, for the rest like I said I have other symptoms that I do suffer from them but uh, compared to my uh, walking situation it's for me personally it's, it's smaller um, a few years ago if you would ask me it used to bother me a lot that I have this tingly feeling I have pain I have um, I have fatigue I'm always tired uh, but uh, my last relapse um, affected me much more so this is my main goal and of course I would like to feel better generally and, and be less tired, be more energetic, uh, feel better. It definitely exceeded my uh, expectations. Uh, way, way more than what I uh, imagined. I didn't expect it to be this way. It feels really um, homey here. Um, uh, the nurses are so nice, so kind. The doctors, everyone, the entire team. Um, is uh, the service was great. Everyone was really great. I have nothing bad to say. Um, and uh, whenever I wasn't feeling so well after the procedure, you know, the nurses, they, they, they were there in a second. Like, they were always, there was always someone uh, next to me um, and uh, made me feel secure. It was a great experience. I, I really feared of it from in the beginning but um, I'm happy I did it and um, it was definitely better than what I imagined before I came here because I did I had no idea what I was coming in, putting myself into uh, but um, but it was really good thank, thank you. you very much for sharing that